Hi, and thanks for taking the time to watch this video today. I'm Tom Ryan with Provider Outreach and Education at WPS Government Health Administrators. This video is on completing the CMS Provider Enrollment Form 855-I for physicians and non-physician practitioners. This video covers Section 15 for signatures for both the medical professional and the organization they are reassigning benefits to. First, I'll explain which signatures to include on the 855-I. The medical professional must always sign the 855-I. This is the person listed in 2A on this application. The medical professional signs in Section 15B. There are also times a signature from an organization is required. A signature is required to accept the reassignment of benefits from this individual professional. The delegated or authorized official for the organization listed in 4F sign the application. This person's signature must be in Section 15C. A common question we receive about Section 15 is, can it be copied multiple times? Yes, you can copy this section multiple times. You only need to copy page 24. You will only need to copy this section when there are multiple organizations listed in 4F receiving the reassignment of benefits. Copy page 22 so that there is a signature for the delegated or authorized official of the organization listed in 4F in 15C. You do not need to copy Section 15 when the professional owns a limited liability corporation or other organization. This information is listed in Section 2D of this application. Section 15 begins on page 23. The opening paragraph and item A explain what the professional and organization are certifying. We recommend that the professional and the representative of the organization read this information before signing. Move on to page 24 to complete 15B and, if necessary, 15C. The two sections are completed the same way. Enter the person's name, followed by their suffix. Have the person sign in the box below their first name. Then have them enter the date they signed the form. That's it for completing the signature section on the 855-I. Remember, the professional signs once and each organization receiving a reassignment must sign in Section 15C. Last, if you need additional help completing the 855-I, watch the other videos in our playlist. If you found this video helpful, like and share it. Take time to subscribe to our YouTube channel and you'll receive notifications of when we post new content. Last, if you have feedback, we'd like you to take our survey. Scan the QR code, which is also a link to the survey. Bye, everyone.